Hello guys, welcome to the channel. We'll be seeing top 10 good harem anime you need to watch. If you're single, please do not proceed. You're still here? Alright then, so sit back, relax and enjoy the video. You had better stay back to the end. You wouldn't want to miss any of the recommended video. Cause I wanna have work. We will be kicking off the list with Cat Planet Cuties, a comedy, romance, sci-fi anime. Meeting people daily is a wonderful thing until you meet one who takes your life upwards or downwards. Our MC by name Kyo is a boring nice guy who meets a hot, cutie, curvy cat girl by name Eris during a memorial service for one of his ancestors. One thing led to another and she now lives with him in the same house. Unfortunately, she's from another planet and is being haunted. Kyo will have to protect her. Next, we have Love Tyrant. I don't know what the writer had in mind, but he would have called the series Kiss Notes because this guy probably watched Death Notes. Well, a girl by name Guri is a cosplaying cuspid that wields a kiss note. Yeah, a kiss note. Anything written there would kiss one another and become couples. The entire series centers around Seiyi, who was paired with Akene Hiyoma, an obsessive and psychopathic but hot babe. This crazy plot twist continues when Guri had to pair herself with them. Next, we have Girlfriend, Girlfriend. If you're single, please don't watch this anime. Well, for you to have watched to this point, you could proceed. This anime centers around our main character, Naoya Mukai, who is an honest fellow and is in love with Saki Saki since they were children. Finally, Saki Saki accepts to be his girlfriend, but he went ahead to accept Nagisa's proposal to him. Who rejects a lady that makes good meals? This causes him to have to two-time them, or more, bro has two babes. The story doesn't end here. Other characters are introduced who also want to date Nagisa. Make on a try, they calm down, Sha. Some of us are still single, you know? A must watch. Next, we have Masamo Kun's Revenge. I already talked about it in the previous video on the channel. It centers around Masamo, who was rejected by Aki Adaki, a rich wealthy girl who referred to him as Piggy for being overweight. He comes back after he is looking handsome and fit. He sets up a plan to carry out his revenge back. A must watch, guys. Next, we have Lord Maxman and Vanadis. Grace comes differently for each one of us. Our main character, Tigre, a young archer, has his entire army destroyed by war maidens. Yes, war maidens. An army of female warriors. Damn it. Well, their leader by name, Ellen, spares Tigre and commands him to become hers. Oh, um, she's starved of men. Oh, shit. Back to the main story. You would have to go check it out yourself to know why she asked for his alliance. Although we all know why. This makes him an only male in an army of female warriors. I wish it was me. Next, we have Invaders of Kokujoma. Our main character, Kotaro, is forced to find a new place. On seeing somewhere very cheap, he jumps in and pays for it. There is a saying, cheap things come with a price to deal with. But this guy is lucky instead. He got four hot babes who are all hot and mythical figures, claiming ownership of his room. Poor Kotaro. Psych. They all agree to live together in this room instead. And that's how this bro got a harem. Yay, you, yes, you, give up your dream of having a harem. Drop a comment saying either no, I won't give up, or yes, I will give up if you're the one. Next, we have a sister is all I need. I already did a summary on this in a previous video. It just centers around Isuke Ashima, who is a light lovingist, obsessed with little sisters, and has a perverted nature with crazy female friends and colleagues. There is more to it than what I had just said. Go check it out in the previous videos on the channel. Next, we have student council's discretion. There is something we usually see over here. You are a man blessed among women. This typically defines our MC, Ken Kusikikasi. He has always dreamed of having a harem, but it came in a different form for him. He is put into the position of the president of the student council due to passing his exams and having the highest score. Why the rest we are females are appointed based on popularity. Bro, on seeing his dreams come true, tried continuously to reach these girls, but they prefer to do other things. I pity this guy, having a harem of girls who don't care about your advances. Nah, 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 that can't be me. Next, we have Yamada Kon and the Seven Witches. Don't mind the witches, I really didn't get the goal of the anime or what the writer was thinking, but what in the world was he thinking writing it? 
It centers around the main character, Ryu Ramada, the lady quaint and violent in nature. One incident causes him to have an accidental kiss with Ora Hasushari, which makes them switch bodies. He discovers he has the power to swap body on kissing someone and swap it back after another kiss. This power is gonna be both convenient and troublesome. Comment if you would accept such a power with yes I will. Finally, we have Nisekoi. I believe most of us have watched it since I already did a recap on it in a previous video. But it centers around three major characters. Yaku Ichijo, the child of the Yakuza gang owner, Chodogo Kurosaki, the daughter of the Beehive's leader, and finally Kosaki Onodara, his childhood crush, who he made a promise to. But he has forgotten what she looks like. A must watch. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, please do hit the videos on the screen to watch contents like this. With that said, don't forget to subscribe and I will see you over in the next video.